both. All right, just showing off yeah, that. A lot fancy. of people like to lean back, but not him. He likes to lean forward. The closer he gets to the monitor, the more yeah, intense it is. I think Tomahawk leans forward too. Like, yeah, there we oh, go. Oh, they talk go. to me nice. All right, so this is just beautiful. Just to let you know, we want to give some uh, rest to those wonderful head pillows of the DX Racer chairs. You know, feel like a cloud. And uh, yeah, just just in case you want to lean back in frustration, they got you, baby. You, you won't go off the stage or into the <laughs> rail and, and, and get so, you know sued by the <laughs> lovely folks at ESA. <laughs> Yeah, be responsible when you're in your chair. But DX Racer got you back. <laughs> All right, here. I think, uh, oh, it's Sophie. It is Sophie. So we're going to go into this matchup. Tomahawk versus Efekai. Again, this is loser side top eight. Loser will be placing seventh place. Winner will move on. Oh, and it's this stage, too. Let's go. I was right, trying to do off. it, but the quickness. We saw Zephakai Zep successful on this stage just a bit earlier. No stranger, but you can just play it straight up, and that 6B coming from Sophie is going to a lot of mileage. When I say that, that is, that is this man's favorite button, <laughs> let me tell you. Yeah, nice. He was able to beat the option there. Obviously, he was going for a guard impact setup. Able to get the grab. Oh, he jumped right over here. Caltrops follow up. Yeah, beautiful stuff there. Tomahawk didn't want anything to do with that stab. Oh. Oh, and he's going to get it. He's going to get it. He gets that interrupt there and the launch and the follow-up. Yeah, tag throw into the immediate offensive follow-up. Yeah, I'm going to take control of my own life. And that's how Tomahawk's been this, throughout the entirety of this tournament, right? Anytime he loses, like, it's going to be on him. He's never going to stay there and, and take it at low health. It's like, I'm not going to try to block all your mix-ups. Look, I'm coming, and you just have to make a choice on how you want to respond to it. Oh, yeah, great reactions there from Zephyrkai, though, getting that huge lethal hit. Nice life lead here. Let's see what Tomahawk's able to do. Look at that, he's playing a bit more defensive now. Waiting for a reaction here from Zephyrkai. Oh, he got him again. He's been using that move six, six. to great success. And right now, Zephyrkai tying it up. One round apiece. Oh, wow. Okay, looking for the stab immediately. Just out of range for that throw attempt from Stormhawk, but it's okay, nothing doing. All's well that it's okay. And uh, they both ended up in neutral. Nice to roll out to escape, but great follow down from Zeph. Nice, this time able to get the throw again. The follow up here, let's see what he does. Man. Both of these players, oh my gosh, the clutch duck, able to get the punish too. Yeah, Seth running in there a little bit too aggressively, and uh, Tomahawk just ready for it, but not this time. Not gonna, he's gonna delay the throw attempt. Oh, and he got him twice, back to back with the 6-6-B, and this time doing a critical edge post-launch, and that's gonna close it out. Seth is gonna go up two rounds to one. Because she's so precious, Sophie's kind of precious too. I too. She's talking to her sword, man, she's crazy. She's crazy, man. I like him crazy. All right, I hear you. No, that's a terrible thing. Don't don't be like me, please. <laughs> gets the side, the step again, gets the follow-up as well. See what happens again. Critical there with that 6-6-B. Again. Oh, that is it. Hey, thanks for playing. I like it. Three rounds to one. Zephyrkai with a statement here. Man, the recent Zephyrkai play, everywhere I've seen him, 6-6-B has just been the go-to win button for that young man. Revis in H-Town, he's in Texas, is trying to figure it out. Yeah, repping for that House of Caliber. Jeez, man, that 6-6-B landed every time he needed it. Welcome to the stage of history. It looks like we're going to go back to a stage change. Let's see where we're going to be playing this out. Yeah, but here's the thing, right? This is LCQ. Winning the first game doesn't mean anything. We've seen that the past 10 <laughs> matches, right? First game means nothing. First game, if anything, is like a warm-up, right? It's like, okay, well, somebody has to win this, so... I wonder if anyone's thinking, like, I'm up one, I'm at the disadvantage now. Yeah. I'm up one, I got to be careful. Very possible. Getting back to this lovely TV stage of week from time to time again. Uh, more ring out potential. But this time, somehow I'm going to, you know, start things off just a bit slower. Nice. Go for the wall setting B Taking here. Taking his turn back and taking advantage of it being hit on, uh, being plus on hit. And Zeph got caught trying to press buttons instead. eats the lethal hit. Yo, Tomahawk is going in right now. One more hit can do it. He might be working on a perfect. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. He lost no. it. Not like what? this. You go up 95%. <sighs> And you can't finish your food? Okay, oh, no. my God. These are starting to hurt me physically. Slow caliber, please. Yeah, that, that has to be bugging them. I wonder if the development team looks at those and, like, smiles when those happen. I was smiling. <laughs> I was smiling. I'm about to throw my headset. All right, here's a punishment right here coming in from Tomahawk. Again, more the same. Very dominant in that final round. Just simply lost to a ring up. But that doesn't mean you can't carry that same game plan and momentum. You just made one mistake, and that's okay. Yeah. And as a seasoned Forgive tournament player, Tomahawk with the answer back to back. You know what's crazy? He should be up two rounds right now. Uh, he, he should, should be, be up two rounds. But there ain't no such thing as should be in, yeah. in the tournament world. 
Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Uh-oh, nice, gets the trade, but gets the lock. Still follow up on the combo here. Again, Zephyrkai, like a surgeon, able to get that cut. There he goes, but he gets that big follow-up here. So good. He has him in the red, too. Had to do it. Had to pop it. Wants to prevent any further damage to his guard meter. Oh, get let, me, out let, of let there. me out of here. Yeah, but follow you down. I like the, the back turn attack from Tomahawk, but just outside of his range of depth. Easy punish, you know, yeah. especially when you're blocking, you're not necessarily looking for anything. When someone just kind of whips a button, it's like, cool. Oh, that throw was that was so kind of high. Sick. That was yeah, high. so sick. The follow up here again. And again, Zeph, you know, continuing here, has him in good position, puts him in the red again. This time, Tomahawk trying to prevent that from happening. Doesn't want to get broken. Yeah, trying to stay clear. Oh, the just have follow ups. 6-6 B, taking it to the sky so many times. So Ooh, effective. Nice I like back it, I like it. Yes, into the offense. Again, Tomahawk, he just doesn't lay down. Leave this place. Here we go. Able to pop. Zephyrkai now going to put the pressure on. Oh, he went for the blockable? Yeah, he's going to go for whatever he wants to. Tomahawk does not allow you to control the tempo. But the 6, I'm going to just stop. You know, I think everybody at home knows this move, and hey. that is going to be it. Zephyrkai actually able to break the streak. Yeah, we didn't go to the final match there. Yeah, he made it a 2 Unexpected. And that favor, yeah, just... Bad positioning, you know, he only had one way to roll, and in that position, uh, 6 b getting the job done. There's the fist pump, and Zephyr gonna live to 